So in the last lesson, we talked about padding. So padding is basically this space in between the content and the border. So right here, right here, right here. And we added 40 pixels of padding all around the content. But it still doesn't look very good. So what we can do is we can add a really nice background image. So what I usually do is I go to unsplash.com because this website provides us with really high resolution photos that we can use in our website. And I'm going to search for summer. Uh, you can search for anything. And I'm going to search for a really nice photo to use in my website. So this one looks really, really nice. I'm going to click download and it gives me this. So what I can do is I can right click on it and click save image ads. And I'm going to save it as background. Okay. I save it and great. It's saved here. Next, what I need to do is go into finder and inside our resume website folder, what we need to do is we need to create a new folder and let's call it images. Okay. And inside this images, we want to drag this new background image that we just downloaded like this. Great. Now we just need to add the background image to the HTML document. So the way we do this is we can say HTML uh, background and then let's provide the URL and that's going to be located in this directory. So background.jpg and I refresh the page and boom it looks like this. Cool. Uh, so this dot dot basically means a directory above. So since this CSS file is inside the CSS folder, we need to jump back a bit here and then say it's uh, in the images. So in other words, there's no images folder in the CSS directory. It's in the resume website directory, which is one directory above CSS. So this is what that means. So this dot dot means let's go one directory above and then inside that directory, let's find an images folder. And inside the images folder, let's find the background.jpeg. Whoops. Okay, so now we have a background image. And this is pretty cool, but it looks a little bit stretched. So in the next video, we're going to talk about how to make this background perfect.